Well guys, we are at Sam's Club. Jess, Jess, get away from there. Get away from there. All right guys, we are at Sam's Club. Gonna do a little shopping, had to get away from Kroger. Looks like they got a lot of stuff here. Let's check it out. And a lot of stuff being Christmas. <laughs> I do gotta say, they do have a nice Christmas selection. Jess just saw somebody leaving here with a tree. Yeah. Jess likes these gnomes. For $35, you get two of them. And what was I saying in the last video? I don't know. You see something you like, you better buy it now because it'll be gone. As I've said before, if you want to buy some Christmas stuff, you better buy it now because they're saying that once it's gone, it may be gone. Uh, we were talking of a, a lot of the things that stores weren't able to get. We're going to see what kind of stuff they have here at Sam's Club. I don't know if we're going to do any major shopping, but we're going to check out all the deals. If you're new to the channel and if you're enjoying our adventures, don't forget to subscribe down below. It really helps us out a lot. We really appreciate Whoa. it. Whoa! These are awesome. So you drop them in like hot milk or hot water and they, I guess, evaporate into that and you can stir it into your peppermint, salted, car salted caramel or milk chocolate. Man, that looks pretty good. For me, I like good old Swiss Miss. What's your favorite hot chocolate? Let me know down in the comments below. Well, we got a week before Halloween. I think Sam's Club has just said, eh, we're just gonna unload all the Christmas stuff. <laughs> Mr. DNA. I did want to point out that if you're still looking for candy to hand out to trick-or-treaters and you need to get a lot, this is a great deal. $23.48 for 525 pieces. And this is good candy right here. Reese's, Kit Kat, Rolos. Not too big on Whoppers or Heath, but that's a big bag of candy for 24 bucks. So you guys may remember from my last Sam's Club video, these Hunter Mix peanuts, they are absolutely delicious. Seven bucks, you get a giant can of them. Uh, I recommend these, they are great. Doritos here, $3.49 for a huge bag of Doritos. Yesterday when I was at Kroger's and did my review at Kroger's, $4.99 for a bag that I don't think was as big as this. As usual, they have their little tastings. This is a little miniature chicken taco. Oh, sure, let's give it a try. That's good. That's real good. Crunchy on the outside, warm on the inside. You can taste like shredded chicken. A little bit of corn. Tasting like cilantro too. That's pretty good. So there are things that I guess all store, Sam's Club being, you know, I guess is owned by Walmart, right? Sam's Club. They have the cheddar parm crisp. They're out of those. Oh, no they're not. Nope, they got some bags down here. Those are pretty good. But supplies are running thin, and I would say, you know, if you're, if you're getting ready for Thanksgiving or the holidays, uh, it might be a good idea to buy a little early, you know, and just check the expiration dates, you know. I do that on everything anyway. Uh, always check the expiration dates on anything. This is the biggest can of nacho cheese sauce I've ever seen. I mean, that is crazy, and it's only seven bucks. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure it's good. Not really, not really sure, but you know, one of them Totino's ones at Kroger, they're like four dollars and you only get about that much. Not even all the way around, like a small can. What you got in here so far? Oh, are these those bites? Oh, okay. Jess got these whole cashews with sea salt. That's good. Can I have any of these? How much are these? Like eleven. Eleven? That's a big thing of cashews though for 11 bucks. It's cost you $40 at Kroger. <laughs> We're not gonna get it right now, but one good deal is this Alfredo. Just likes making chicken Alfredo uh, for about six bucks. You get three of them. One of these is normally like $349, $399. So that's a <laughs> great deal. We save $2. We eat corn with just about every meal. Eight of them for seven bucks. Uh, that's a pretty good deal. Uh, they are $1.25 at Kroger per can. They, they haven't gone down or up. I assume they'll go up at some point, so we're just going to get eight of them. Now, you guys have seen that they have had problems at Kroger with Chicken Noodle Campbell's, which I did see at another Kroger's the other day that they were pretty well stocked. But they do have 
the big pallets of them here for ten dollars and they run over a dollar uh, fifty a can now I think they were like a dollar eighty nine a can so this is a huge savings that's less than a dollar a can so great deal right in the middle of the store if you feel it is necessary they have a hand washing station right here you can eradicate all germs pretty convenient I mean <laughs> kind of strangely placed I guess but if you're gonna be opening up the doors and there you go one thing's for sure, they are definitely good, well stocked on soda pop. This place is amazing, guys. Absolutely amazing. If, if you're not afraid to spend a couple extra dollars to buy in bulk, you're really getting a, a great deal in the long run. Jess just brought up an interesting point. We like getting these uh, croissant sandwiches, but the only problem is, is that if our fridge is pretty well stocked, we have no room for them. We can't fit the box. We actually have to take the packages out and kind of just fit them in there. Now that is a super pretzel. Honestly, the worst thing for us about buying a lot of stuff at Sam's Club is having to haul it up, haul it up three flights of steps. <laughs> Gotta go for the Gogurts. Well, we found another tasting station, Honey Crisp Apple. Our whole purpose for coming in here was to find something for dinner. We're gonna start working on that. Over here by the meats and everything, they always have these rotisserie chickens going. Five dollars, we got a huge rotisserie chicken. And they were out, and it's like, man, when they come off the line, they smell fantastic. We got one, five bucks, they're huge. Uh, three times the size of the ones at Kroger, and, and you save three dollars. Jess loves her croissants. I should not have come in this aisle, me or Jess. We got the croissants. We also got these apple turnovers, and whatever this epic awesomeness is. Cherry Danish. Look at that, and lady was telling me, they make all this stuff in-house, except for the bagels, everything else, all the pastries, all the cakes, everything, they all make here. That's awesome. All this walking around, it's always nice to have a little snack. Came up here to the food court, got a nice buttery pretzel, Pepsi, $2. This whole combo, what a great deal. I leave Jess alone for two minutes. Look what she bought. <laughs> we got the gnomes. It's a good thing, too, because they would probably definitely be sold out of these. Really not a bad deal. $35 for both of these. So Jess always puts together some awesome stuff. I didn't do anything. I just took the chicken and took the croissants we had and cut it in half and put chicken on it and made mashed potatoes. Doesn't that look delicious? Oh, but she, she cooked the Yeah, I cooked croissants. the croissants so they get a little crispy. Yeah. Yeah. So I, I have a question. I don't know, but I have an answer. Do they? So they put butter on them? Mm -hmm. Okay, because I was gonna say they smell real buttery. Oh, uh, yeah, all butter. Oh. Ah. Time to eat. Uh, pretty awesome. He's uh, shopping. Well, a lot of you guys were watching our uh, Kroger video, and we saw firsthand how it was completely wiped out. Sam's Club is not wiped out. Uh, I feel like they had some things that were gone, but some stuff. It depends on really what you're looking for. Yeah. And I mean, obviously, you gotta buy in bulk there, so it's different. Yeah. You can't just go in and buy one can of corn or something unless you're getting like this big of a can of corn. Right. Yeah. <laughs> gotta buy eight cans, which we got. We got all kinds of stuff. We got the gnomes. You did end up getting them. Yeah. Uh, yeah. We got out of there. Right. Jess was. I had already uh, checked out when I went and got the pretzel. Yeah, I scan and go everything, so I don't have to wait in line. <laughs> yeah, and. uh that's yeah. Let's talk about that for a second. It's amazing. So every yeah, everything you get. Just open your app on the Sam's Club, and then you can scan and go. Like mine already has my card and everything saved in there. So like all you do is just scan everything that you're putting in your cart, and then you check out, and then it gives you this QR code that they scan at the front, like they do with your receipt, and then they just scan a couple items to make sure that you bought everything. Really and awesome. That's it, and it's so easy. You just walk right out. And you don't have to wait in any lines or anything. Only thing that sucks is if you want to pay in cash, you have to do it. You do have the to wait in line, yeah. So uh, Christmas stuff. Yeah. Looks like they're loading up. So they. I wonder if they get more. I, I don't know. Uh, I, I was basing everything off of what they had for Halloween, which wasn't much, but I wouldn't. I don't because think Christmas Sam's is usually bigger than. Halloween. Yeah, for a store like that, I'm sure it is. And I only saw two Christmas trees, so I feel like they might get more, but I don't really know. It's kind of late now, so. Yeah. 
Who knows? What a trip to Sam's Club, though. Good to see it. You know, for the deals that you get, if you're not, like I said, if you're not afraid to spend an extra dollar or two to buy in bulk, you're going to eat it eventually, right? So, yeah. yeah great day at Sam's Club. Uh, thank you so much for watching the video. Uh, again, if you enjoyed, don't forget to subscribe down below. It really helps us out a lot. We really appreciate it. Yeah! <laughs> so, uh, yeah. With all that being said, we are out. And always remember, the adventure is... Out there! Bye! Thank you.